Sometimes when you're masking thin geometry, you end up masking the back faces as well. And if I just use my pen, my mask pen here and mask this part here, you see that the back of the ears here are masked as well. If I turn on back face mask, going to auto masking in the brush palette, if I press control and turn on back face mask and I repeat this process, can see that the back of the ears are not masked anymore. Now the problem is that if I use other ways of masking, for example rectangle, now back face mask is actually ignored and I can use even mask lasso here for example, make sure that back face mask is on. If I use the lasso you can see that the back is also masked. So I'm just gonna use rectangle here and do this. So the back face arm is masked as well as you can see even though back face mask is on. And now if I press clear back face mask, first time you press it you're gonna get this message that lets you know that these will clear your poly groups if you have any. And you can recover your poly groups by using this copy group paste group functionality in the geometry tab. And it will also delete your undo history and I'll show you how you can get that back later on. So I'm just gonna say OK here. You can skip till next restart and now you can see that the back face mask is gone. So this works with any type of mask brush. So if I select for example lasso and I just grab this bit here and this, this time I'll do it for the front. So I'll press OK and you see that everything in the front was cleared. Now I'm hoping in future versions to correct the situation where you lose your undo history. Until then what you can do is let's say I have some um, geometry changes here. I'm just gonna do this right now. So let's say you want to keep the, your undo history, that stroke. You can duplicate your model. Then you can do your masking and use the button, clear back face mask. You can do your changes whatever they are. Now if I clear my mask, I can come down to geometry, press go to modify topology, press copy and, and now I can delete this one. Okay and I come back to this original one and I can do a paste replace and this way I don't lose my undo history.